Over the centuries, people have seen the ghost of a Celtic warrior here in the undercroft of Carew Castle. He's tall and wears trousers of Brethen Catre, a Welsh homespun material, with a cloak over his shoulders. He stands quietly enough in his corner and seems to be waiting for something or someone. About 2,000 years ago, there was a tribe of Celts living at Carew. They lived in a wooden fort with a fence round it and a number of very deep ditches to keep their enemies out. They needed to defend themselves because other Celtic tribes would come and attack them and try and steal their food or seize their women or capture slaves. One day, the head of the Karoo tribe called his men. He said, men, we're going to have to go and hunt for food in North Pembrokeshire. Rodri, he called one of his men over. Rodri, I want you to stay here and defend the fort. We'll be away for about three weeks. Now, Rodri would much have preferred to march out of the fort with his friends and chase wild boar across the slopes of the Priscelli Hills. But he stayed. He stayed and he waited. And the weeks turned into months and no one came back. He waited and in the end, he was killed by an enemy soldier. But his ghost is here at Carew, waiting for his comrades to return. But they don't come back. 